This video looks at two typical third questions. The first is to rationalise the denominator. Now to do this, we times the top and the bottom of the fraction by root 2. Now 5 times root 2 is just 5 lots of root 2. But root 2 times root 2 is root of 4, which is just 2. And this answer is it. We're finished. And what we've achieved is we've moved the square root from the bottom of the fraction to the top of the fraction. And we've therefore rationalised the denominator. Now, in part two, we're asked to expand and then simplify this expression here. Now, a square just means the same bracket times by itself. So, we have to work out that, take away this. Now then, if we expand this bracket, we get 2 times 2 is 4. We get a 2 root 3 from that, and another 2 root 3 from there, which is 4 lots of root 3. And then root 3 times root 3 is root of 9, which is just 3. Now, if we then expand the second pair of brackets, we get a similar type of thing. 2 times 2 is 4, but now we get a minus 2 root 3, and another minus 2 root 3, which is minus 4 lots of root 3. And then at root 3 times root 3 is root of 9, which is 3. There's two negatives, so it goes positive, so it becomes plus 3. Now, a lot of things say will cancel off, because 4 take away 4 cancels out, as does 3 take away the 3 here. So we're left with 4 lots of root 3 take away minus 4 root 3. Well, two negatives go positive, so 4 root 3 plus 4 root 3 becomes 8 lots of root 3. So we've expanded and then simplified to get 8 lots of root 3.